I'm I'm fine. Stacy, don't leave. I can't believe. What are you what are you what are you talking about? Seriously. You shouldn't leave the bar. You're pretty hammered. <laughs> no, I'm not Bailey. I'm perfectly fine. Look at me. You're not fine. Just just please come back in the bar. <laughs> no. I'm heading home. Right. Um hi. Hey. Just please listen for a second. You're you went too many shots and too many drinks and I'm just afraid you'll get hurt. Don't Don't be afraid. I'm yeah. You're not even saying anything. I'm fine. Fine. Can't find fine. I'm just gonna walk home. Please don't do that. Well, at least you're not driving, but just, just don't. I'm going anyway. Stacy! Chill, nothing's gonna happen. No matter how much I ask, she'll never listen. <sighs> Whatever. I'll be, I'll be fine. <sighs> Maybe I am a little drunk. But that doesn't mean anything. It just doesn't mean anything. Just, uh, Yes, it was. I don't know, dude. I'm so just. I will probably never figure out what that was. <laughs> probably, probably nothing. Didn't worry my oh, too much. Hello? Is someone there? Hello? This is a weird town. <laughs> hey! It's fine. She's gonna be alright. Alright, alright, she's not gonna be alright, she's a drunk girl, you don't let weird Sam guys out there. Yeah, and? And, he could, he could, he could, just calm down. Ugh, you're so drunk right now, I don't need this from you, Bailey. You let my girlfriend go, you understand that, right? I do, she's just... She, she's gonna be fine. She can take care of herself. Not when she's freaking drunk. <sighs> I'm going to go find her. Don't. Come on. <sighs> I'm going. Thanks for the non-help. <sighs> Blake. Whatever. I'm not gonna go help find her. She'll be fine on her own. He just has to accept it. Maybe if she's dead, I'll finally get a chance at him. Can't believe him. <laughs> Too drug out. I'm halfway to the apartment. It's gonna stay. Well, hey there, lady. 
<laughs> what? Is the trash talking to me? Uh, affirmative, young lady. Uh, ow. Uh, hey. <laughs> so, where have you been? I've been at a bar all night. You know, Barker's or Bark or whatever it is. I see, I see. So, you got out of your cash on ya? Eh, no. Then you get that weed anything? No, I really don't have anything on me. What? Really? Are you, are you sure, young lady? Aren't you, girl? You're wearing a bow. It's the only clothes I can really find, you know? <laughs> What's your name? <laughs> it's Sam. Some people call me Smoker Sam. <laughs> Too much weed will get you that name. Yeah. Uh, I'm Samantha. What a coincidence. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, tell me a little bit about yourself, Samantha. <laughs> well... I mean, <laughs> if you want to, we can go on a date or something. No, I'm really not interested. Are you actually? No, I'm not. <laughs> well, young lady, you're going to learn something about me. I love a fight. Just stop it. <laughs> you're not as quite as drunk as I thought. See you then. <laughs> Back to the trash I go. Home. Huh? What? Where are you? No, please. Please don't hurt me. No, please. No. Sam. Sam! Why are in? Samantha, where are you? Samantha? Samantha? Oh my gosh. I need an ambulance. Hello, my name is Leslie Nope, and today we're on the crime scene today. It is the murder of Samantha Williams. It has been a tragic event, and we have contacted the fam her family, and they are all very sad. Of course, we couldn't get an interview from them for our little thing, but of course, we will have to get them another time. So... Can you tell us any information about how you found the body? Well, I'm not supposed to talk about it, but it seems it was a bear attack. A bear attack? One that's big? Yes. Seems to be very scarce. We're waiting for our lead investigator to get here to ask people some questions. That is great information. Thank you for joining us. I've been Leslie Nope, and we are about to continue this in a few minutes, so please, stick to the channel. Alright, we just have to wait for the commercial brain to go back live. Hey, you two. We're gonna have to ask you for me to leave. You cannot be filming here. What? I am on the news channel. Yes, and we're asking you to leave very kindly. Another murder. Caused by me and my wolfness. No one ever said a werewolf would be easy, though. Come on, Alan, Tristan. Come on, baby. Give me a uh. Hey, Tiffany, what's up? Hey, you know what? What? Guess what's down your street today?
Okay. A uh, crime scene. Yes, a crime scene in your way. We're gonna go see. A uh, crime scene. Yes! Wait. You were on TV, weren't you? You knew it. You killed him. What are you talking about? <clears throat> Sorry. I guess being funny isn't really my thing. I see. So I was thinking maybe we can head down to like, you know, the crime scene and get some like Taco Bell on the way. This is bribery. I hope you know this. I do. And I'm accepted. Yay! I love you so much, babe. I love you too, Dev. Yes. Now, let's go see some murders. Love murder. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's the other way. We're going to see murder! I love you so much. Wow. Leaves are really annoying today, aren't they? Yeah. Stop talking about the police. His girlfriend just died yesterday, and it seems like you don't even care, Daisy. What? Of course I care about him. Then why aren't you being supportive? I could use you not arguing in front of me, and my girlfriend said bodies over there would be very helpful. Sorry. Yeah, I'm, I'm so sorry, Blake. It's fine. Just can't believe she's dead, you know? Like, I. It's really hard to deal with. Like, she was so young. I know. But it'll be alright. Oh, Blake. Hey, how's it going? What are you doing here? To support you, of course. <laughs> I mean, what else would I be here for? I would rather you move away, since you were the one that got my girlfriend killed. <laughs> what? I didn't get her killed. She ran off, you know that. <laughs> yeah, but you could have stopped her, and she wouldn't be dead right now. <clears throat> it's not like I could do anything. Well, you should have tried to do something. <laughs> Whatever. Ugh, can you just go away? Like, you just make him feel worse. Ugh. You know what? Whatever. Screw you. I don't even like you, Angel. What? Your glasses wearing? You're just such a nerd. Why don't you actually just leave or, like, kill yourself? <laughs> hey. Will you stop it, Blair? <laughs> Do I really have to? I would like you to leave. I fell down. Aren't you going to help me? Ugh. Hey! Ugh. You're so annoying. Come on, get up. I don't understand. Why does she hate me so much? Maybe because she's in love with Blake? Like every guy? <sighs> Whatever. <sighs> what do you have for me? Oh, Mr. Newborn. Um, uh, I'll show you. Well, the victim has been a brutally attacked properly from behind and how do you figure that well there's a pool of blood around her and she has many lacerations in her neck body even her head well that seems to be a lot then it is sir cause of death uh, I would say the last uh, she bled out, that's what I say. 
Maybe, did you see that fatal wound to her neck? Oh, um, just look at it more carefully next time. Alright. Okay, sorry. Who was the man that found her? Or women or fishtail or whatever. Um, it was a boy whose name was Blake Underwood. Oh, I recognize that. You do? Do you know where he is right now? Not at the moment. I'm pretty sure he's over there. Alright. Well, I'm going to go ask him a few questions. Uh, alright, sir. Hope you find something. Anything. What fools. Thinking they can actually find this out. <laughs> Humans amuse me. This has been the first episode of Oops On! Yay! I really hope you guys enjoyed this, and if you have, please leave a like, and I'll see you in another video.